often referred to as one of the most avant-garde musicians today. Omar Rodriguez Lopez is not one to be put in a box, evident by the many bands he has helped build, including At The Drive-In and the disbanded Grammy-winning The Mars Volta. But as usual for Omar, he has not wasted any time on the back burner, teaming up with Terry Genderbender in a new experiment called Bosnian Rainbows. I've made a lot of different types of records, same thing from acoustic to electronic records. Mars Volta was designed to be a, a vehicle for Cedric and myself. So it was just, you know, us and we, we were the composers and we were the, the, the two collaborators and then we just hired musicians to play our music. And so after 11 years of doing that, then you, you want, you know, to, to be, a, again, in a collective situation. I put together the band just based off of various collaborations that I had been doing with the Butcher Rats. We were already hanging out and I, you know, I pitched them the idea and just said, you know, I wanted to do a new group and pitched her the idea. And so, uh, you know, so it happened quite naturally. You know, I just uh, wanted to do something different. And so, you know, it seemed like a perfect uh, opportunity and pairing. <laughs> It's been nice because we were like a family. Hell, I'm close. I'm closer with, with them than with my relatives. You know, so it's. We spent we spent a lot of time together, and we've been touring as Bosnia and Rainbows. And so luckily, we've we've been able to tour everywhere and play to uh, people who like music. And so it's not so much like genre or like this or I only like that. You know, people who are open to music. There's lots of different things that have happened over the years, and so that opens up the spectrum. And, you know, obviously it won't be for everybody. Just anything goes, you know, because we're so hungry to, to just uh, create, destroy, create, destroy, digest, create, you know, life, infinity, destruction, chaos, life. Uh, I think we're all just sections in time. We shouldn't be attached to that section because eventually that will pass. So don't think in genres or in anything, but we might as well enjoy what we're doing without thinking what's going to hit, what's going to be successful or not. Yeah, I agree. I think that the yeah. thing is like, uh, you have to create for yourself. Your music or your, whatever art you're doing will be a byproduct of whatever your intentions are. Music is a vehicle for us to express ourselves, so it's, it's that type of thing, you know.